starting with clean skin I use the gelatine prosthetic from Nimba Creations, which I've already pre-painted to a kind of skin level. And then I'm using Prosade on my skin, not everywhere, and on the piece as well. So I did kind of want it to look like a mask and not stuck too much. And it also fit for a man's size, so it was clearly too big for me anyway. Um, but I just thought I'd do it on me rather than get a, a male model in. So I just position it in places, I get some string, tie it around a little bit. On one of the sides, the string did snap, unfortunately. So in hindsight, if I was going to wear this or have a man wear it, I would have put a lot more glue on than what I did. So then I started to use Mr. Face Paint. It's already a liquid form, so it's easy to just use with a sponge straight away without activating it with water. And I wanted a messy clown makeup on top, as if I was this sad clown. I was kind of doing it like just loosely and freely, messy. Kind of as if I was a drunken clown. Um, someone who wasn't exactly skilled in face paint was kind of the theme and the idea. So the prosthetic itself is already good. It's obviously already sad and upsetting. So then I'll just go in with some water and I'm spraying it directly to the paint. As you can see, it's giving it that watery, upset kind of tears of a clown effect. Very messy. Um, and I just really like that effect actually. So yeah, really simple this design was. The painting of the skin effects was a lot harder. 